playing games up there. He's trying to hold me up high. I'm trying to cross him over, and it nearly wrecks him. And so it's it was it was fun. I mean, in retrospect, now that nobody had any problems, the best car won. It's it was fun in the moment. It really was to to be able to race and have fun like that. Uh, but it was it was fairly clean. I didn't see anything. It was just so hard to get to anyone that. Um, it kind of forced us to be cleaner than normal. You've got that big number of 60 in line, so you got a few this year. How do you kind of sum up getting towards that number? Yeah, I mean, I really wanted to be at 53 by the end of this year. If I went back to back these last two weeks, I'd get there, but uh, I think 52 is feasible. I think that we'll, we'll be ready for next week and, and certainly perform at a, at a high level, but I do. I It's just a personal goal of mine because I know that that's what I can control. I can't control you know, sometimes if you have bad pit stops or a, a power steering belt fall off, I can't control that. I can control what I can, and that's be a contender every single week. And if you can win that many races, you're, you're a contender every week. And that's just a personal goal that I would be happy leaving the sport with. Ruddick and Bubba had good, you know, they were up there. They came up, fell back, whatever. But overall, their, their playoff performance, you got to be proud of the inroads you've made so quickly. Sorry. No, it's all right. The inroads that 2311 has made, I mean, just in the playoffs alone this year. Yeah, both of them exceeded the the, uh, the goals that we set forth. We've talked about that. And, you know, the 45 definitely had an off day today. The short tracks have not been his thing. You know, it's something that we're going to work on it with him uh, in the future and, and certainly can work on it with him even more when I'm retired and I, I don't have to compete against him. But I, I, I do. I try to my best to lead those guys down a good path and, and I think that it, they're on a really good path and they've continued to get better at every racetrack they've been to so you know to, to be part of the you always want to be part of the conversation until the last race of the year you want to be in the last race but like we've always all of us have been relevant until Phoenix right and so that's a really good accomplishment and um, it's a good building block for, for next year. Last question. Stepping in late, tell me the frustration of not being able to make it in and being so close. And where did you fall short? I mean, it's it's tough to, you know, the easy answer is we fell short because we had a mechanical failure last week, and, and that's that was that was it just puts on such deep hole that um, a phenomenal day like today it wasn't quite enough.